people of the internet, I am Arkane3000 coming at you with another review, and this time it is the Jack Specific Movie Knuckles. Um, here he is in the packaging, he's well displayed, and the box is basically almost exactly the same as the movie Sonic. Here's the back, shows off the Knuckles figure, as well as the other characters from the wave. His bio reads, Knuckles is one tough echidna with no time for small talk. He's on a mission to find the greatest power in the universe, and action speaks louder than words. Cool. And that's it for the packaging, so let's get on to the actual review. For accessories, Knuckles comes with the exact same uh, snowboard accessory that the Sonic figure came with. And I do mean the exact uh, same snowboard. Which honestly makes sense. We both see Sonic and Knuckles um, uh, snowboarding in the trailer, so it just makes sense for him to have this. Although, I... I just think they should have just gave him his own unique accessory, like a Chaos Emerald or something. Like the Sonic figure, the sculpt of this figure is quite phenomenal. From the fur texture, the little details of his shoes, and... Something I didn't notice while reviewing the um, uh, movie Sonic is that... Both Sonic and Knuckles' muzzles are smooth, although they, I guess... Jack Specific could have sculpted a fur texture to them to give it a more screen accurate look, but it's not that big a deal. Um, uh, sculpt looks good. Paint wise, it's decently applied. His um, uh, little white um, uh, mark on his chest it looks a little um, uh, fuzzy, although I think it makes it look a bit more realistic as opposed to um, uh, the belly patch on the Sonic figure. And, uh,. Paint looks also also looks good. For articulation, Knuckles has a um, uh, swiveled neck, although he's it's very limited from his um, uh, dreadlocks. He has ball jointed wrist and feet. He has universal shoulders and universal hips. His el he has a single hinged elbow with a swivel, and his knee is also single hinged with a swivel. And that's it for articulation. For scale, here he is next to a um, uh, standard um, uh, six inch figure. And now for some comparisons, here he is next to the um, uh, movie Sonic from the same wave. And finally, here he is next to his um, uh, video game counterpart. It's kind of funny seeing the differences in designs between the movie and video game versions, how the proportions are all different. It's kind of funny. This is a really cool figure. I think I might ac actually like it more than the video game Knuckles figure. Mainly because of the um, uh, better posability of the figure and the um, uh, less um, uh, cartoonish proportions of the video game art style. So yeah, that is my review of the Jack Specific Movie Knuckles figure. If you like this review and this video, please like, comment, share, and subscribe if you wish to see more content from me and... Be sure to hit that bell icon to get notified for future videos. Thank you all for watching.